Good day browsers of YouTube. Now today I've just got a real simple video and we're going to be taking a look at the female side of things with Prison Architect. Honestly there is really not much difference, it's all minimal. Uh, don't judge my prison, it's a mess, it's literally just one I made. Um, yeah, so I, honestly what I would say the main thing is that makes it a challenge is the pregnant people. Because when you uh, select an intake to get more prisoners, it doesn't actually tell you if you're going to get pregnant people as well. So you kind of, you always have to have space to make a family room or have one available. So, the only difference is that you have to have this, which is the family cell for each mother and child. And then you also have the nursery. Okay. The reason being is that the nursery is pretty much where they'll spend the majority of their day. Uh, even their food gets brought here into the nursery. You know, they won't go in here and get involved in all of the crowds and that. Uh, they ha they do come out occasionally. Like, see here, she came out into the yard. You see, they need sleep a lot of the time. We find that. <coughs> uh, watching the video on the release of these, uh, some of their moods are slightly different. Like the pregnant ladies, pregnant ladies that have been pregnant, had children, uh, they get like more stressed, and their needs are quicker than that of general women. Okay. Also, something else you might want to know is that when a male guard is fighting a female prisoner, male guard has a higher chance of winning that fight, like due to just like the general perception of brute force, I guess. Um, so yeah, they fight, honestly. Apparently they don't fight as much, but I found they fight just exactly the same, if not more. And their fighting is funny, because like, they, they do scream genuinely like little girls. Oh, there we go. I don't know if you hear it, if they're gonna scream. Yeah, a little scream there. But yeah, they do fight a lot, and it's just it's really annoying. Um, I find that they spend half their life here in solitary. I mean, it's already pretty much full, but I, it's fun, like, because just being able to also have female prisoners. Uh, my mum also plays this game, and she's been playing it with the new female prisoners as well. Uh, what she said, and I think, you know, could be a good idea, is having, you know, like a separate wing for females, and then also a separate wing for males, because that does happen in real prisons, but... It would just be a lot harder to segregate it. It's more of a challenge, if you like. But we all want a challenge on Prison Architect. Um, I wouldn't really say there's anything else to tell you guys. They're literally they're the, <laughs> they're just the same as male prisoners, except they have more needs and they're bitchy little fights constantly, and they're always screaming. Uh, privacy as well. They always want privacy because I'm in a dormitory, but you know, stick them in cells or whatever, make them happy. Uh, that's it. Yeah, you guys want to start making some female prisoners and go for it. Uh, I have been downloading a couple different uh, mods. Like, I have this clock, which means I can fast forward things uh, just like, a bit faster. And I also have a mod that shows their needs bigger, like it's a bigger bubble and it tells you it. So, if you want to download those, just search them up in the Steam Workshop. They're definitely worth a download. Uh, there's so much stuff you can download off there. And there will be more that I'm downloading, and you can see. Also, don't forget to get your uh, your Polaroids whenever you see them. So, thank you for watching. Uh, please do subscribe because there will be more videos. Uh, every like helps. You know, just scroll down right now and hit that like for me. If you're not signed in, please do sign in. And stay tuned. And I hope you enjoy future videos. So, thank you.